Have you ever wondered how long your fruits and veggies could last if they had an extra layer of natural protection? Welcome to a journey that explores a revolutionary food preservation method appeal. Imagine a world where your fresh produce has an extended shelf life, reducing food waste and unnecessary trips to the grocery store. This isn't science fiction, but a reality brought to life by the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation's initiative. Appeal is a plant-derived edible coating applied to fruits and vegetables, offering potential benefits like increased shelf life and reduced need for chemical preservatives. But like all good things, it also has its drawbacks, including cost considerations and potential impact on small-scale farmers. And of course, we can't ignore the elephant in the room, the long-term health considerations. So are we looking at a revolution in food preservation or a Frankenstein additive? Stay tuned to learn how our peel could change the way we preserve our fresh produce. Let's dive right into what a peel is. Imagine a knight in shining armour, but this knight is not protecting a castle. It's safeguarding your fruits and vegetables. This knight's name is Appeal. Appeal is a remarkable innovation in food preservation, a plant-derived edible coating applied to fresh produce, forming a protective barrier that extends their shelf life. It's like a second skin, an invisible shield, that helps produce, retain moisture and fend off external elements that can lead to spoilage. But how does Appeal do this? It's all about harnessing the power of nature. Just as our skin protects our bodies from dehydration, a peel provides a similar protective layer for fruits and vegetables. When applied, it slows down the rate of water loss and reduces the exposure to oxygen, two key factors that contribute to the deterioration of fresh produce. So what's the magic behind this invisible shield? It's not magic, but science, and a simple one at that. The application process of appeal is straightforward and doesn't require any complex machinery or equipment. Fresh produce is dipped or sprayed with appeal, and as it dries, it forms a thin protective layer around the fruit or vegetable. Now, you might be thinking, but isn't this just another chemical additive? Here's the beauty of it. Appeal isn't a synthetic chemical concoction. It's made from materials that we're already eating, lipids and glycerolipids, which are found in the peels, seeds and pulp of fruits and vegetables. In essence, a peel is made from food for food. It's a revolutionary approach to food preservation that goes beyond just keeping fruits and vegetables fresh for longer. It's about making a positive impact on our environment and addressing one of the most pressing issues of our time, food waste. That's appeal in a nutshell, a plant-derived edible armor for your fruits and veggies. It's not just about longer lasting produce, but also about a sustainable future for our planet. But what exactly is this armor made of, you might wonder? Well, appeal is not as mysterious as it may seem. It's actually made from the same materials we usually toss away while preparing our meals. The formulation of a peel is derived from lipids and glycerolipids. Now, those might sound like complex scientific terms, but they're simply the fats found in the peels, seeds and pulp of fruits and vegetables. These are the very same elements that naturally protect produce while it's still growing on the plant. A peel takes these protective properties and amplifies them creating a second skin that provides an additional layer of defense against spoilage. This plant-derived edible coating forms a protective barrier around the fruit or vegetable, effectively sealing in moisture and keeping out oxygen. These two factors, moisture loss and oxidation, are the main culprits behind the spoilage of fresh produce. By blocking them, a peel extends the shelf life of the fruits and vegetables it covers. But what about safety, you may ask? Can we really eat this stuff? The answer is yes, appeal is food. It's made from food, it's applied to food, and it's safe to eat. 
In fact, the US Food and Drug Administration has given appeal the green light, classifying it as generally recognised as safe or grass. This means that it's considered safe for consumption based on a long history of common use in food or on the results of research. However, it's crucial to remember that just because something is labelled as safe doesn't mean it's suitable for everyone. People with specific dietary restrictions or allergies should always check the ingredients of any product they consume. In the case of appeal, it's made from plant materials but the exact composition can vary depending on the source of the lipids and glycerolipids used. In conclusion, our peels are essentially made from food waste, the parts of fruits and veggies that we usually throw away. It's a sustainable, natural and safe method of preserving fresh produce. So our peel is pretty much made from the same stuff that's already in our produce. Let's take a look at the potential benefits of using a peel. One major advantage lies in its ability to extend the shelf life of fresh produce. Think about it. How many times have you had to toss out fruits or vegetables because they've gone bad before you had a chance to use them? It's not just frustrating, it's also a significant contributor to food waste. But with a peel, we can keep our produce fresh for up to three times longer reducing the amount of food that ends up in the trash. And that's not all. A peels plant-derived formulation offers a natural alternative to traditional chemical preservatives. This is a breath of fresh air for those who worry about the potential health risks associated with synthetic additives. With a peel, we're looking at a solution that's derived from the very foods it's designed to protect offering peace of mind for health-conscious consumers. But Appeal's benefits extend beyond our kitchens. Its potential environmental impact is something to be excited about. By reducing food waste, we're not just saving money, we're also conserving resources. Every piece of fruit or vegetable that's thrown away represents wasted water, soil and energy. By extending the life of our produce, Appeal helps us make the most of these resources, supporting more sustainable agriculture practices. Moreover, by reducing the need for refrigeration and cold storage, Appeal could also help cut down on energy consumption and greenhouse gas emissions. This could be especially significant in regions where access to refrigeration is limited, offering a means of preserving fresh produce in a more energy efficient way. And let's not forget the potential impact on global food security. With a longer shelf life, fruits and vegetables can be transported further, reaching markets that would otherwise have limited access to fresh produce. This could help improve nutrition and food availability in remote or underserved communities. In conclusion, appeal could be a game changer for reducing food waste and promoting sustainable agriculture. It's a solution that's not just practical, but also aligns with a growing consumer desire for natural, environmentally friendly products. However, no solution is perfect. As promising as appeal may sound, it's worth noting that there are a few potential drawbacks to consider. Let's delve into those for a moment. Firstly, there are cost considerations to take into account the process of applying appeal to fresh produce isn't free and these costs have to be absorbed somewhere along the supply chain. This could mean that appeal treated produce may initially be priced higher than their untreated counterparts. While this might not be a concern for everyone, for those on tight budgets, it could be a deciding factor. Next, we have to consider consumer acceptance. While appeal is designed to be invisible and tasteless, some consumers may still be hesitant to purchase produce with a visible coating that they are unfamiliar with. It's a new concept, and as with any innovation, there might be some initial resistance to change. Education and transparency about what appeal is and how it works will be crucial in overcoming this hurdle. 
Finally, let's discuss the impact on small-scale farmers. The adoption of appeal technology may require investment in new infrastructure or equipment. For smaller producers, this could pose a significant challenge. It's important that as appeal becomes more widespread, measures are put in place to ensure that smaller farms aren't left behind. This could be through subsidies, grants, or other forms of support to help them adapt to this new technology. In conclusion, while appeal has the potential to revolutionize food preservation, it's not without its potential drawbacks. It's a balancing act between the benefits of longer lasting, fresher produce and the potential challenges that come with implementing this new technology. As consumers, it's important for us to stay informed, ask questions and make choices that align with our values and our budgets. As with any new product or technology, it's essential to weigh the pros and cons before making a decision. There are some potential concerns that need to be addressed as appeal continues to gain traction. But with open dialogue, ongoing research and a commitment to transparency, these challenges can be navigated, bringing us closer to a more sustainable and waste-free future. What about the long-term health risks? This question is a crucial one that anyone considering the use of appeal-treated produce needs to ask. So let's dive right into it. Appeal is formulated from plant-based materials, specifically lipids and glycerolipids found in the peels, seeds and pulp of fruits and vegetables. These are generally recognised as safe for consumption. However, the key word here is generally. While there is a consensus that these components are safe, it is based on their traditional use and consumption in the foods we eat. But when these substances are isolated, concentrated and used in novel ways, such as in the formulation of appeal, it's fair to question if the safety profile remains the same. There is a need for more comprehensive research into the potential long-term health effects of these substances when used as part of appeal. Just as we've seen in the past with other substances that were initially thought to be safe, it's only with time and rigorous scientific research that we can fully understand the potential health implications. The use of appeal also brings up the question of regulation. Currently, appeal falls under the category of generally recognized as safe or GRAS by the Food and Drug Administration. This designation is given to substances that are widely accepted by qualified experts as safe under the conditions of their intended use. However, the GRAS designation is based on the presumption of safety and does not require the same level of scrutiny and testing as food additives. This means that while appeal is deemed safe based on current knowledge and usage, there is a need for transparency and greater consumer education regarding its long-term health impact. Consumers should be aware of what they are consuming and the potential unknowns associated with it. In conclusion, while appeals ingredients are generally recognized as safe, more research is needed to fully understand the long-term health implications. It's important to keep asking questions, stay informed, and make conscious decisions about what we put into our bodies. So where can you find appeal-treated produce? This is the question on everyone's lips as appeal continues to revolutionize food preservation. And the answer is closer than you might think. In the United States, Appeal has partnered with some of the biggest names in the grocery industry. Costco, one of the largest wholesale giants, has been stocking Appeal-treated avocados since 2018. The results were so promising that Costco expanded the range to include asparagus and limes. Then there's Kroger, the largest supermarket chain in the United States. They've been offering appeal-treated produce in over 1,000 of their stores nationwide. Harps Food Stores, a regional supermarket chain based in the Midwest, has also jumped on board the appeal train, stocking appeal-treated avocados and limes in all their locations. 
But it's not just the United States that's embracing this revolutionary food preservation technology. Appeal has made its way across the pond to the United Kingdom, partnering with major supermarket chains like Asda and Marks and & Spencer. These UK-based stores are offering appeal-treated mandarins and oranges, providing consumers with a fresh, longer-lasting fruit option. And the list goes on. In Germany, Adika and Netto Mark and & Discount are stocking their shelves with appeal-treated avocados and oranges. In Switzerland, the Migro supermarket chain is offering appeal-treated avocados with plans to expand their range. So what fruits and vegetables can you find with Appeal's protective coating? The answer is quite a few. Avocados, asparagus, limes, mandarins, oranges, and even apples are being treated with Appeal's plant-derived solution. It's exciting to think about the potential for even more types of produce to be offered with Appeal's protective barrier in the future. It's clear that Appeal is making significant strides in its mission to reduce food waste and extend the shelf life of fresh produce. By partnering with these major food store chains, they're bringing their innovative technology to the masses, making it easier than ever for consumers to choose fresh, sustainable options. But remember, while Appeal is opening doors to a more sustainable future, it's essential to stay informed. As consumers, we have the power to drive change in the food industry. By choosing appeal-treated produce, we're not only choosing a longer-lasting, fresher product, but we're also supporting a company that is actively working towards reducing global food waste. So keep an eye out for appeal-treated produce next time you're grocery shopping. You'll be surprised at how many stores are now offering these long-lasting fruits and vegetables. And remember, every time you choose an appeal-treated product, you're taking a step towards a more sustainable future. Let's quickly recap what we've discussed. Appeal is a revolutionary plant-derived coating applied to fresh produce that's formulated from lipids and glycerolipids found in the seeds, peels, and pulp of fruits and vegetables. It offers numerous potential benefits, including extending the shelf life of produce, reducing the need for chemical preservatives and supporting sustainable agricultural practices. Yet, it's not without its potential drawbacks, such as higher initial costs, potential hesitancy from consumers and the impact on small-scale farmers. There's also the question of long-term health considerations, which calls for further research and regulation. Appeal has already made its way into leading food stores in the UK and the USA. But it's up to us, the consumers, to make informed choices about our food purchases. Remember, staying informed about advancements in food preservation technology is key. And don't forget to subscribe for more content on 